and welcome back i hope you're all having a wonderful day and today's video we're going to be testing and trying out and reviewing and looking at butterfly the butterfly series from sxc so i actually had to like show you the packaging on my bed because the box was too big for my desk so it comes in like a big box and then there it is <laughs> and then inside the big box are two other boxes so the first box is a 24 watt um nail lamp uh led uv uh, i don't know how good this lamp is though because yes second time this lamp has a usa cable for like a plug not US, uh, UK so I couldn't try it out because obviously we've got three teeth on our plugs not two it comes with instructions and it also comes in like this little uh what is this it's like a foam bag I don't know it's it's a bag uh but it's not a bag it's like material I I, I don't even know what sort of thing that is anyway it's 24 watt and uh yeah, don't know how good it is because <laughs> I, I couldn't use it. And then the plug comes in a little box here. And as you can see, it's a US. Excuse my hair on my desk, but the way I wore my hair in a ponytail today. And it's my hair so long that it just like drapes everywhere. Kind of like cousin it. But yeah. So then the next box, of course, is the polygel kit itself. And... Uh, I love the uh, packaging. I think it's very, very nice. I, it's very muted. Like, it's not overly done. The butterfly is, is gorgeous on there. I don't know why I'm so excited about it. I'm excited because it's SXC. It's the first time I've ever done an SXC video. And the only reason that I'm doing it is because I actually won this in a giveaway. Yeah, one of their giveaways. I won it. So, these all the, the colours there they're showing you. It also gives you instructions, this little booklet, and, like, tips and tricks and things that you need. So, yeah, it was very thorough. I think that's very nice. Um, Like I said, though, I won this in their contest, like, gosh, around Christmas time. But I haven't gotten around to using it yet. And, oh, I, I love it. I love SXE products. And there's their... Uh, the other collections as well so the top tray is uh, the poly gels and the brush and then the bottom tray is like your top coats and your decorations and all that stuff this kit comes with loads by the way um so yeah i am an i am an ambassador for sxe but um i didn't know <laughs> until like recently <laughs> um so whilst we're going through the box here it comes with a poly gel brush. By the way, this poly gel brush, the, the lid went on so nicely. Like, they they feel sealed. Do you know what I mean? But they weren't, like, hard to pull on and off. But they went, yeah, I, it's hard to explain. And the brush the brush has, like, uh, SXE. And it also has, like, this little butterfly. Can you see that? That's so cute. And then, like, little designs on the either end. Anyway, going to talk about um, SXE really quickly. So, I'm, I'm an ambassador. I got a 10% off discount code and an affiliate link, which is down below. You don't have to use the affiliate link if you don't want to, or the code if you don't want to, but I do get a little commission back if you do. Um, yeah, this is the first kit that I'm reviewing, and like I said, I won it in the giveaway, but I didn't know I was an ambassador until, like, not long ago. I had an email, uh, and no, I went on my... Um, my like affiliate link thing and it was there and I was like oh okay <laughs> um so yeah I I'm really chuffed and uh thing is though because I'm in the UK I can't actually get these kits unless they're sent to me by SS SXE themselves um because uh obviously I, I can't get them if I physically can't get them then nothing I can do um but like I said I did win this so they did send it to me so yeah I hope one day they do start um shipping it over to the UK because I know a lot of people want to try SXE Cosmetics products in the UK um but sadly there's no of getting on anyway going back to the kit so this does come with it comes with butterflies it comes with stickers it comes with a matte top coat as well as the normal top coat and base coat um it comes with these beautiful uh i've not had i don't have these but they're like little like uh nail embellishments they're all sealed as well which is a really nice touch because usually these things are never sealed and they just pour everywhere uh it comes with the nail file basically it comes with everything plus 10 different colored poly gels plus um 
loads of decorations so you can really go all out with this kit and it will last you a while the only thing is it doesn't have slip solutions so you would have to buy some rubbing alcohol 70 percent plus uh will do you just fine but i really like this little touch i think this is stunning um and i'm really happy with the uh the kit itself and i can't wait to use like these decorations on other things look at that that's so adorable like oh that's so lush i love this kit i want them all now <laughs> SXE start sending them to the UK. Gosh, I'm just, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> so there are 10 different colours and there are different names, as you can see on the screen. They all come sealed and uh, they are all 15 millilitres each. Um, I'm not going to read out all the names, but you can see them there on the screen. Now. It's, yeah, I think they've done really well with this. So they are jellies, of course, and um, there is a nice variety here, but I have to be honest. Um, the They're very, very sheer in colour when you do put them on your nails. Uh, it just, I can't explain it. it well, no, they're jelly colours, and you don't need that much. So, like, building, you don't want to build the nail too thick, so you end up like with a very sheer coloured nail. So because I knew they were going to, because they're jelly colours and it was the same with the McCart jelly uh, set. I thought, okay, we need to, and uh, uh, Savvy Land's flower thing. I think it's just jelly colours are very sheer. Um, but if you don't mind it being sheer, like this is still is a nice kit and I did really enjoy it. Uh, so I got the McCart iridescent glitter. Uh, stuck a butterfly to my finger as well. <laughs> got some gold foil. Uh, leaf, whatever you want to call it, and I also took the lid off of those butterflies that come in the kit, and I'm going to use that to decorate the nail. By the way, this base coat was really, really thick. Like, I was like, okay, it felt like a builder gel, and it's not necessarily a bad thing that this base coat is thick, it means that it won't run or anything like that, and that's nice. It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's good to to know so anyway going on to the nails now uh so i've just put some base coat into the nail and now i'm just pressing in some of that iridescent glitter and then around the iridescent glitter because i've kind of done like a swoosh swoosh swooshy swoosh an s i don't know um <laughs> sorry so i've basically uh done the glitter and now i'm gonna put the um butterflies and the gold leaf all around like the glitter kind of following the glitter up the nail and i do this to every nail and they turn out really cute i really really like them uh they this oh it's just i i, I had so much fun i can't wait for summer because we get to do all those summery butterfly and cutesy nails again you know and i'm here for it i love that sort of stuff you know um i used to be like oh i can't wait for christmas nails and now i'm just like i cannot wait for <laughs> go the spring and summer nails it's just, yeah. So, like I said, I'm just sticking everything in. It did turn out kind of like a butterf butterfly fairy sort of set. I was really, really impressed. And uh, by the way, I am going to say this poly gel is a dream to work with. It's so nice, guys. It, it wasn't sticky. It was definitely up there with, like, McCart sort of textured poly gel. I'm really impressed. Um, I'm always impressed by McCart, of course, but uh, this is the first time I've used, I've done SXC products. And uh, yeah, it was a really nice to work with. It wasn't too firm, but it wasn't like, sorry, it wasn't too thin, but it wasn't expect, it went like really, really firm. It was more, what am I saying? It wasn't thin or sticky, it was firm. <laughs> There we go. It was firm and it was it just it it was like a dream. I was so impressed by it. So basically, what I do is I decorate all of the nails. I've done two on thing, and I'm just quickly doing these ones because you've seen it twice, and I don't think you want to see it over and over and over again. But I'm just sticking butterflies randomly, different colours into the nails, some glitter and some gold foil, gold gold foil. Um, and once I've done this bit, I then cure my nail lamp for thirty seconds before applying the poly gel. So um. Yeah, it's pretty simple, pretty easy. It was a simple set. I really enjoyed doing this set and this method, as always. I'll link some videos in the cards, uh, because I have done this set, of course, a lot, uh, this sort of method a, long, a lot of times. Uh, it's created by Femi Beauty. Um, but anyway, uh, moving on. So once I'd cured, oh, I'm still going. I'm still putting stuff in. See, I was just like, oh, da, da. Uh, so yeah, the, the colours, like I said, they are very sheer in colour, and they do... They, they are very transparent. Um, 
but I was still happy with it, you know, I was still happy with the set I made, um, and they turned out really cute, and I'd highly recommend, well, I, I can't highly recommend them right now, because I've only tried one kit, but if all their poly gels are like this, someone let me know in the comments if anyone else has used, like, more than just one kit of <laughs> SXE, but, um, yeah, let me know if, like, all of their poly gels are like this texture because if so then I would highly recommend it um but like I can't go off just one kit I would recommend this kit uh if you don't mind like sheer poly gels like there's nothing wrong with sheer poly gels sometimes it is nice to have a very jelly sort of clear set you know um so I'm just putting in some slip solution into my dampened dish here and then I just press my brush into the bowl just to wet up the bristles and take out any of the packing powder that might be in the brush um and then we move on to the poly gel so i decided i'm going to use every color so that we can get a proper like look at the colors so i just used two colors on each nail um patted and pulled it into place and i only had to dip my brush once per, per nail you know um so that was great <laughs> so that shows how not sticky it is so yeah i just uh pressed and pulled the poly gel into the right space and then once i was done I stuck it onto my nail, like the dual form, um, made sure to clean up around the sides and the back, and then I cured for 20 to 30 seconds, depending on, like, how long I wanted to put my nail on that, basically, and I just moved on to the next nail, and I do this for every single nail until I'm done, and then I do a full cure at the end for 60 seconds, um, you don't take the nail tip off or once you've cured, I'll link my playlist, because I've done this method a lot, this method was called the Lazy Girl method, but I think Femi Beauty has now changed the name to the Femi Beauty method. Or is it the Femi method? Either one, it's one of the two. I can't remember, but I know it's the Femi or Femi Beauty method now uh, because people weren't giving her credit. Um, so that's that. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. So, uh, like I said, I do like an ombre sort of thing for each nail. Um, and like I said, I will link my playlist in the cards uh, because it's a little different from the jewelful method if anyone's here this randomly new uh, but I'm gonna put some music on and let you guys watch this bit and then I'll be back when we start to top coat because I don't actually file with this method only like a little bit on the tip if I need to because everything's done that's the great thing about this method but anyway I'll be back in a minute guys <laughs> And I'm back, guys. Hello. So now that the uh, poly gel is all cured, by the way, I loved how they looked in the lamp. Did anyone else? They were like glowing like blue, but they're not glow in the dark. Um, so basically, I thought, okay, let's just add these stickers. Let's use everything in this kit. <laughs> so basically, on three of the nails, I like altered between like my thumb, my middle finger, and my pinky. I added uh, butterfly stickers to those three fingers, and then on the other two fingers, which were my index and my ring finger, I used my McCart glue. By the way, uh, you can get fifteen percent off. The affiliate link is down below again. Uh, you can use it if you don't want to. You don't have to, but like, I get commission, a little bit of commission but it's completely up to you, uh, so I get a little bit back when you do use it. Sorry, that was like a 
wild mouthful there. So basically I just popped some blobs of this rhinestone glue and I'd highly recommend it. It's amazing. I, I don't use anything else. I went to use the Amelie Builder Gel because it was on my desk and then I was like, no, wait, where's my rhinestone glue? And I swapped over. Um, <laughs> so yeah, and then what I'd done was whilst it was still wet, I stuck my butterflies into the uh, wet um, rhinestone glue. It's gel, of course. Uh, and then I made sure that they were placed right where I wanted them and I cured uh, for 60 seconds before taking my, uh, my hand out of the lamp and then top coating. Um, so you can top coat first and then um, do that, those little butterflies, I didn't think. But the rhinestone glue, it actually cures untacky. So there's no tacky layer, so you can put it on top of to, uh, top coat as well. I then top coated underneath and this is the end result guys. Of course I use cuticle oil as well. Yep. Uh, but yeah, this is the end result. I'm really happy with them. How stunning are they? They're so pretty. Oh, I love them. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I hope you're all having a wonderful day wherever you are in the world. Don't forget to keep on smiling and don't forget to stay safe and I'll see you all in my next one. Love you guys. Bye.